What's up guys, this is David from How To Ghost, and today I'm gonna show you how to embed tweets and Facebook posts into your ghost blog. So we have a text-based post for each of these. We have a one for Twitter, one for Facebook. I'll link to both of those in the description if you wanna follow along or view either of those. So for Twitter, what you, go, what you do is you go to Twitter, you find the tweet that you want. Uh, I'll go ahead and do this photo when I had those two awesome monitors behind me. Go ahead and click on the more button and then embed tweet. Go ahead and copy the code it gives you. Go to your ghost blog and paste it in. I'll call this post Twitter. And now let's paste it in. Go ahead and just hit publish. It'll look a little weird here, but when you hit publish and actually go to view it, you can see that it styles it all correctly and then puts it right in line with all the text that's in your blog. So that's it for Twitter. It's really easy to embed a Facebook or a Twitter post. So let's go ahead and let's go back. And so now to do Facebook, what you do is you go to Facebook and it's actually very similar. You click on the little drop down arrow, hit embed post. Again, copy the code it gives you. Let's make a new post, we'll call it Facebook. And then just paste their code in there. Again, it'll look a little weird, but publish. Let's go ahead and let's view it. And there you go. There's the Facebook post that's embedded. So that embeds it in line with all the text that you have. If you need to add extra styling, you can. I think they have a couple different options, like you can include the media or not. But say you want to add it to your actual theme because you want to show up across the whole site instead of just in this one blog post. You can do that very easily. You just take the exact same code and paste it where you want in your theme. So for example, I have the themes default to HBS open. Say I wanted the Facebook post to show up at the top of my site for whatever reason I wanted this one. I'm just going to go ahead and paste it in here. It's the exact same code. Let's go ahead and, and let's go to the home page. And there you go. You can see that it's up here. Now obviously this is styled horribly, but you can style it or put it wherever you want, change the size, anything that you need to like that. So that's it for embedding tweets and Facebook posts. If you have any questions, definitely feel free to leave a comment. We come out with new videos every Wednesday, so feel free to subscribe. And thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next week.